What is a blog? If you visit the URL you're seeing in this video, you'll be taken to Wikipedia, which defines a blog as a type of website or part of a website. Blogs are usually maintained by an individual with regular entries of commentary, descriptions of events, or other materials such as graphics or videos. Entries are commonly displayed. You can read all this. And basically what this means is it's a website. But it's a website that allows for you to create and post content without having to know HTML. Now again, you can read through this entire site and it gives you a good history of a blog, how it got its name, the origins, how popular they are, the political impact, and there's just so many reasons why blogs are what they are today. But for the purposes of what we're doing here, a blog, in our sense, is a place where you can create content, good quality content to share with your market in your area or niche of interest. Also at the same time, it allows for you to post up ads or share links or anything like that and help you in the marketing of a particular niche or interest. So looking at this sample you see here, this is actually a blog in the internet marketing niche. And you can see just by the popular tags uh, of all the different uh, internet marketing type terms. Um, and you'll see also a list of archives and categories and recent posts and of course some advertising. Again, that's in the internet marketing niche, but you can also use them in pretty much any niche, as you see here. This is a guitar playing niche, and it's basically the same principle. Lots of quality content that gets posted by the user or the owner of the blog, and also, same thing, categories, ads, advertising, links. You can link back and forth between other favorite sites and blogs. And why is all of this important? It's important because in the world of search engines, specifically Google, because let's face it, Google is the biggest right now, they love blogs. They love blogs because they see them as a site of authority. The reason why they're seen as a site of authority is because site owners or blog owners typically add quality content on a regular basis, adding fresh quality content. In other words, when people are searching, for example, on how to be a rock and roll guitar star, what you'll find here is a nice informational article. That's exactly what the search engines want to see. But of course, while they're here, they can feel free to click on advertising. Another thing the search engines love about blogs is aside from the fact that they're usually looked at as authority type sites in a particular niche, they're also great for the community aspect of people getting involved of people adding fresh content to your site right along with you. And what do I mean by that? Now, pretty much anybody that has a blog and they put up articles or discussion topics will also have the ability for readers to get involved and create comments. So at the end of a particular post, users will see a place to leave a reply or some sort of uh, feedback. And what makes this useful for people to comment is because most bloggers will allow you to put a website link, allowing you to have a link back to your site from this particular blog. Okay, now let's take a look at an example here. And you take a look at a post just like this one. You see that there's usually a little indicator when there's a comment. So what you can do, you go in and take a peek. Now again, as a blog owner, you can make sure that uh, only appropriate comments are made uh, in various ways, such as approving comments uh, prior to them being seen, having uh, good solid spam tools, and we'll go through that in uh, upcoming videos. But you scroll down to the bottom of the post and you'll see there's a comment. Okay, and this is good interaction on the internet. Okay, uh, again, with the search engines, especially Google, they look for this type of interaction. When they see people commenting on your blog, that looks upon your blog as, again, a site of authority. So again, that's what makes this very, very important. And because search engines such as Google love these blogs, they tend to get ranked very quickly. And also above, say, for example, a one-page sales letter. That's going to be very important in the grand scheme of things for what you're doing here at Affiliate.com. And also, as noted before, and we're going to get into this in another video. It is extremely simple to post brand new quality content. You don't need to know HTML. So once again, go ahead and visit this Wikipedia site. You'll see the URL below. 
and read up a little bit about blogs. This will help you understand uh, why they're going to be instrumental in what we're doing here. Thank you.